Hello everybody, and welcome back to a new Let's Play. It has been a while, it has been a long time, I know. I have become very lazy with YouTube, I know that. But, we're back here with a new Let's Play. We're playing a scary game, yeah? This is the first scary game Let's Play I've kind of done in this channel. Now, I did two videos on Amnesia the Dark Descent. I did some streams, but I never finished it because I was too much of a pussy. Uh, I got about three, four hours into it, and I could not complete it because... This is the scariest game I have ever played in my life, and uh, I did watch a lot of videos on it back in the day, but I cannot really remember anything other than the fact that it is terrifying and the ambience is the... It's awful. It's awful in the sense that it makes you want to shit your pants. So, we're going to be playing through it today. Um, to anyone who's wondering why I've been gone so long, um, yeah, I just got a bit lazy with YouTube. Um, I might make a video on it. I don't really know. But for now, I'm back. Making a video, and I'm gonna stick to it. If I don't stick to this let's play, you can bully me. There you go, that, that's that's your reward. If I don't stick to it, you can bully me. Okay, so we've got three games here. Um, I have no idea what Justine is, um, but we're gonna just we're just gonna play Dark Descent. If I do like it, I might play Machine for Pigs. Um, if you, if you guys like it, I'll play Machine for Pigs. Um, or the new one that came out, because I heard it's uh, I heard, I heard it's de it's decent. Um. But yeah, oh, Amnesia. Remember, the, remember this game back in 2012 and PewDiePie and Markiplier and almost every bloody YouTuber on the side used to play this game? Oh boy, oh boy. It still holds up today. It still holds up as one of the scariest games of all time, honestly, I think. Uh, not many games have beat it in that category. Welcome to Amnesia The Dark Descent. What follows is a couple of quick, quick messages on how to get the best possible experience. Amnesia should not be played to win. Instead, focus on immersing yourself in the game's world and story. Hmm. Let's think about that. Do not worry about when and how to save during gameplay. The game will take care of that for you. When you want to leave the game, just choose save and exit. Yeah, that's going to be happening a lot. You can then you can then use continue to turn to where you left left off next time you start up the game. Okay. The world of the world of Amnesia is a dangerous place, and you are extremely vulnerable. Do not try to fight the enemies in kind of instead use your wits, hide or even one if necessary. Uh, that, that's not concerning at all, is it? The interplay between light and dark is very important to the game because this is vital to serve the game the gamma correctly. Use a slider control below to do so. Adjust into the square. The light is barely visible. Oh okay. Yeah, that's that's to the left though. Hmm. Okay, I think that's a, I think that's good enough brightness. I could put it all the way up, but that is all. Hope you enjoy immersing yourself in the world of amnesia. Mm. Don't know if I'll enjoy it, but uh, it'll be interesting. Alright, uh, okay, so let's see. There's no audio settings. Interesting, okay. Uh, oh god. Names will spot you more easily. Thunder Thunderboxes and oil are harder to come by. Auto save is disabled. It's disabled? And see if your game costs tender boxes. Losing your sanity will kill you. Oh yeah, let's go. No, I'm playing. I'm playing no more difficulty. Screw that. Oh, uh, I, I'm I'm a platinum trophy hunter. So if this game does have a trophy, a platinum trophy, mm, it's gonna be tempting, but I probably won't be able to do it because that sounds incredibly difficult. I apologize for the crappy camera quality, by the way. I'm using Don't my Mac. Some things mustn't be forgotten. The shadow hunting me. I must hurry. My name is Daniel. I live in London at... You are a fellow British man, I see. Mayfair, what have I done? This is crazy. Don't forget. Don't forget. I must stop him. Focus. My name is... Is... I am... Daniel. Daniel. So Daniel Fortescue. Are we playing as Sir so Daniel Fortescue? I hope we are. Interesting. So yeah, like I said, I did do a few streams back in the day. I think I might have the video still up. I cannot remember. All I remember is I had a very bad quality. <laughs> and that's it. That thumbnail was awful. I did again. Oh, my own thumbnail was kind of awful. <laughs> oh, I see. Okay. At least once since yeah, I'm playing on the pro, so I, I think the game actually looks a bit better because it's because it's, it's the pro. I mean, there was been out of the journal. Momentous. Follow the liquor trail and find its source. Okay. If I remember correctly, nothing much happens here. I 
think. That's a big I think. Oh god. Daniel! Daniel, have you been drinking? Daniel's been drinking. He has been drinking. Fuck. It's been, it's been literally 20 seconds and I'm scared by a, a, a door opening. Jeez, this is not going to go good. Oh, I see. Okay. Oh, it's a tender box. tender box. I'm definitely going to be making PewDiePie references in this. Oh, 100% I am. I don't think I'm in there. Uh, uh, we gotta go on this. Oh, I thought it was going to be a spooky dark hallway. Definitely not. Hello. Oh. Daniel, what did I say about drinking? Oh, oh well. We need to put bad habits away. There we go. No, no. There we go. Good. See, this is your path to recovery. Oh, it's Mr. Chair. Is that what I threw again? I knew it was a way to throw. There we go, it's L1. Hmm. So keep that in mind, I can throw chairs. So if I get chased by a scary monster wanting to rip my face off, I can throw a chair at him. Okay, well, was there any point in this room? don't think there was. And if there was, I can't find it. Okay, let's go. Hmm. So there's no one option, then, I think. I think it's, this is the stable PSU one app. I could be wrong, though. What's in here? Oh, fuck. Okay, that's just not. I'm just not gonna disturb them. I don't trust you. Oh, I can pick up your head. Bump. Okay, how about we just... How about we just get a sharp object or something like this and we, you know, we just... Because in this situation, I think I take my chances by leaping from the window. Maybe just me, I don't know. Uh... There's nothing over here. Oh. Okay, we don't need we don't need to use the tinder boxes, so I'm not gonna waste them. Because if I remember correctly, they are vital to our sanity. So we do not go insane. Oh, that part went flying. Okay, I did say I have to follow the liquid trail, so... Um... Oh! Oh, it goes to that door. I thought the door was closed. Oh dear. Oh, it is! It is open. Okay. Something I get a bit, a bit freaked out, not gonna lie. I, I said I wasn't going to waste the tinder boxes, and I just did. Nice, okay. Oh. Is, is someone like drinking like a slushy? Has someone just been dipping slushy everywhere? Hmm. Oh, I don't like this. I really, really don't like this. I don't like it. Oh god. Jesus, Dan is tripping the F out. Oh, Jay, you need to stop drinking, dude. Okay, follow the pink trail. Follow the pink Could you not? Could you just not? Could you just. No, just. <laughs> Could you just not? Could you just not do that? Fuck. Damn it. Okay. I need to stop swearing. Sorry. Uh, is it anything? It's you again. Right, you're gonna be my protection. Okay, I need to get started. You're... Come with me. No, I said come with me. That... It... There we go, thank you. Oh. I oh, got my sandy shopping. Okay, I'm sorry. You're gonna be my protection. If anything comes to me, you're gonna smack him... Smack him in the face. Okay, the blood vehicle's in there, but this door opened, so I'm gonna go in here. Please don't be a jump scare. Okay, okay. Hmm. What's this? Oh, it's the crucifixion of uh, our little Lord and Savior, I think. Looks a bit different than the, when the, than the books described. I don't know if there's two other people near him. Was there two other people near him? I think there was. I can't, remember, can't remember. That's a really, that's a really fat guy. Really, really fat guy. It's very nice scenery, though. See, this is what I do when I'm playing horror games. I just distract myself with the dumbest things. You're gonna be seeing that a lot. Don't worry. Okay, Mr. Chair, you're coming with me. Okay. 
don't know how long I'm gonna, I'm gonna be making these episodes, but we'll see, we'll see. Once again, uh, I, I got interrupted by the game earlier. Uh, my ca my camera quality is not good because I'm using my Mac. Um, I could, s I might switch to my camera. Um, I just don't have a good, like, setting up position for th the old archives. Okay. He fell to the kitchen floor. Tears were beginning to well in his eyes as he received the first kick in his stomach. Tears remained hidden in fear she too would be punished. Okay. Whatever that means. Can we take one? Can we take this? Oh, we can. Okay. It'd be very handy if we could take them. Oh, look. What's this, what does this say? I don't think we can beat what it says. Okay. Oh, gee. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Ah. Interesting. Okay. Ah. Uh. What's in here? No! Housekeeping! Is anything going to rip my face off? I hope not. Well, unless you're into that, I mean. Yeah, that's that way. Um. Box. Box. Oh, oh god. Oh, oh, oh god. Hmm. Those cockroaches? Those cockroaches? Those are very big cockroaches. Oh my god, could you not? Could you just not? Please. Thanks, thanks, I really appreciate that. I really appreciate it, in fact, yeah. Where is that light coming from? Must be, that, mo that moon must be vibrant on its side. Um, why is there suddenly like. Why are all the corridors blocked by giant boulders? Uh huh, uh huh. Oh, I don't like that. I really don't like that. Can we turn the sensitivity up? One second. Uh, my, my, I'm moving. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Look, look sensitivity. Thank you. Oh, all the way up. Oh, that's so much better. <gasps> oh, it's a lantern. It's a lantern. Yes. We have light. I can actually see now. Jesus. Lop. Okay. That's good. Um. Oh, oh, a tinder box. Tinder, tinder, tinder box. They are going to be our best friends in this game, I think. Book. Hmm. Oh, we can one. Okay, it's L2 to one. Ah, oh, okay, I see. I see. Well, it's, it's like Jog, not really one, per se. Hello? Okay. Just... Jesus, this place is having some violent earthquakes. What is this? What is this, America? Oh, it's a broom. Oh, no, it's in the box. Okay, I'm gonna shove this. The monster's mouth. No, I'm joking. Uh, I don't want to do anything with that. Boxes. There's a lot of boxes. Oh. What is this? <gasps> oil. Oil, oil. Okay, um, yeah, we need that. Is there anything else? Oh, what's this? Ooh, leather. Oh, okay. I don't, I don't know if I was meant to find that yet. What's this? 19th of August, 1839. I wish I could ask how much you remember. I don't know if there'll be anything left after I consume this drink. Daniel's don't not to be himself. Afraid, Daniel. I can't tell you why, but know this. I choose to forget. Try to find comfort and strength in that fact. There is a purpose. You are my final effort to put things right. God willing, the name Alexander of Brandenburg still invokes bitter anger in you. If not, this will sound horrible. Go to the inner sanctum, find Alexander, and kill him. His body is old and weak, and yours, <coughs> young and strong. He will be no match for you. One last thing. A shadow is following you. It's a living nightmare, breaking down reality. I have tried everything, and there is no way to fight back. You need to escape it as long as you can. Redeem us both, Daniel. Descend into the darkness where Alexander waits and murder him. 
your former self, Daniel. Uh, okay, so we both talk to ourselves, and then we consume something that made us have amnesia. Alrighty then. But why did we? Why did? Why did we consume the drink? Why didn't we just retain our memories and kill Alexander ourselves? Hmm? Hmm? Why did we? I guess we'll find out, to be honest. Storm snatched up behind him and he knew he would never again see the old tale of Berkeley Square. Another lone soul in London seemed appropriate. This is a, okay, it's a big room. I like this. This makes me less scared when it's light and it's a, it's a big room. Okay, I'm gonna put this... How do I put it down? There we go. Just so I don't waste it. Oh, jeez, oh. Alexander, is it inside the castle? Right. In a manner of speaking, come, bring the lamp. You've been to the refinery, have you not? I don't believe I have. Is it connected to the... What did you call it? The inner sanctum. My most precious chamber, Daniel. Yeah, what is that? And it lies well beyond the refinery. In fact, it lies beneath the very stone of Brennenburg. Jesus. Okay, we can't. We can't. Okay, whatever this is, I, I, I can't get past it. it. Looks like something from Xenomorph. Okay. Are those horse pedals? Or blood? Is that blood? It could be blood. Because if that's blood, that's the freshest blood I've seen, like, in a game ever. Because <laughs> blood goes brown after a while. <gasps> oil! Not that tasty oil. Don't, don't eat it though. You'll die, but you know, you know what I mean. It's the chair, you're gonna protect- oh, whoa, it's in the box. I say, I say you're gonna protect me now, so you don't instantly. Uh, he's just gonna stay there. He's just gonna stay there. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> Let's not go that way then. Okay. I think running does make more noise, but I think this early in the game, I, I think. I think. I hope. I'll show about that. No, I don't want to download Java. Hmm. I'll leave that for. Oh, for God's sake. Oh, what's this? Oh, something over here. Oh, something over here too. Ah, uh, more boulders. Um. And now, now it's golden. Now oh, it's yellow outside. What the hell is going on outside? The tab tabula tabula labium. Oh God. Frequent taste of booze lingered in his mouth. Turkish delights, he thought, just like the ones at the consulate in Constantino Constantinople. I really don't like Turkish delights. I don't know. I don't understand anyone who likes Turkish delights. It's one. It's one of those shockers where it's just like, why? I miss this maid. What invokes you to make this? Oh God. Hmm. Right. So I need to get a bit scared. Oh, oh no. 16th of May, 1839. The unflinching African sun has continued to plague our expedition, making it impossible to dig until dusk. How Professor Herbert managed to find the location in these vast plains of nothingness remains a mystery to me. When I asked him about the tomb again, he told me about the legend of Tin Hanan, the mother of us all. An interesting story in its own right, but I can't help feeling there's more. Later that evening, we uncovered a passage beneath the dunes leading to a sand-covered stone structure. The professor was confident it was the tomb we sought and ordered the others to clear the way late into the dark, cold night. Tomorrow, I shall lead the men into the ancient structure, hoping to reach the burial chamber. No matter what the professor is keeping from me, the dig should yield something interesting to take back to London and the British Museum. That seems like similar to the, the new game, because it takes place in a desert. I don't know if it takes place in Africa, but it, it does take place in a desert in an ancient tomb. So, hmm. Interesting. Okay. Right. Open this. There we go. 
Hmm. Nothing in there. Good idea, Mr. Jack. Oh, it's in the box. Tinder, Tinder, Tinder. Tinder, Tinder, Tinder. Is there anything this one? No. Another note. I hereby offer my full attention and services to Alexander, Baron of Brennenburg. This contract will be in for a total of three years when my freedom shall return to me. In addition, Alexander, Baron of Brennenburg, is to recommend my services at the Prussian Royal Court and within the sanctum of the Order of the Black Eagle. May no man break his seal. Wilhelm Hoyce of Gerwick. Whatever the hell that meant. All oh, these British names. Oh, it's too British. It's too British. Catalogs. Oh, it's a nice. It's got some nice paintings, to be fair, this place. There's one positive I can give it. Oh. Okay. Hello. Not doing. Like the ambience in this game is. Mm, I don't like it. Oh, I don't, really don't like it. No, no, no. 17th of May, 1839. My hands tremble as I write. I feel a need to document my tribulation, for I fear that my memory will fail me if I linger. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. Mm. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I must have language and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. You mean just a different the language? It's so strange. It's just a different language, dude. Confused me. It looked much older than the fourth century structure we had expected. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with statues unlike any I'd ever seen. Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it, and as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. I was trapped. Oh boy, he was trapped. Well, the guy we're playing out right now. Oh, tinder box. Ah, oh, god damn it. Ah, oh, shit. Right. Fuck. That's not good. Oh, this is really not good, actually. Fight, fight. Just give me, just give me more light. That's all I need. More, more, more oil? Can you give me more oil? Maybe. Just maybe. Hmm. Okay. Oh dear. That's a very nice bending too. Oh! Oh my god, we can actually see outside. Looks like it's snowing. Huh. It's pretty nice looking. Nice. Oh god, okay. I'm getting a bit scared now, I'm not gonna lie. I don't. I don't know if I will finish this let's play. <laughs> now that I'm playing it, it's like, oh, oh god. I'll, we'll see how far we get. We'll see how far we get. Oh, um, more oil. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you. Oh, I, I didn't know I had. Is that two? Uh, I already have one. Especially downstairs. Here, here, and there. Let's get the servants working on it. Oh, God. Die. 
Who's all behind me? Oh, it did. Okay. Where to go now? Hmm. What's in here? Fragile but not breakable by hand. Alright, so we're gonna have to find something to break it then. Won't we? Let's see. Oh, another note. This must be the end of it. Or not? Okay, I'm gonna have another epileptic seizure. Damn, stop drinking, Daniel. Of May, 1839. After pounding the unforgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized. 1839. Jesus. I was trapped. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's when I saw a faint blue shimmer. My weakened body was heavy to carry, but I managed to There's push myself toward the enchanting light. It was waiting for me. Enclosed in dark nothingness, I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. I reached out, closing it in my it hands. Spiral jam? escaped my fingers and began to spark brightly and spirit me away. Unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless deserts, and impossible geometry. The next thing I can remember is the grating sound of stone being lifted. The voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety. And grasped firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most peculiar relic. Mm. I see. Looking for something to break that wall. Right now, there's nothing I can use to break it. Must be in here then. Right. Okay, I don't, I don't like that? Okay. I guess not. Let's turn the box again. I intend the box to be out actually. Got two. Oh, I thought we had more. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. That's what I like to see. Okay. Um. So I'm looking for maybe a hammer of some sorts. Blop. East wing. I don't need the east wing, I need a hammer. Seem to be in this room. Um, is it over here? Okay, we can do that. That's a thing that can be done. How do we open this? Hmm. Far job, but not breakable by hand. We just need to get chair. Go. It's, it's worth a shot. <laughs> oh, still an object. I didn't think that was gonna work. I did not think that was gonna work. <laughs> oh, I can jump. I didn't think I could jump. You have to be swift when you activate the first one. You hear that? If it stops, you'll have to start over. Isn't all this a bit? Excessive. You can never be too careful, Daniel. Alstadt and Brennenburg, also 1801. Another region which with lore is Alstadt, whatever. I don't know how to pronounce that. Deep within the East Prussian woods, for centuries there have been stories surrounding the hamlet and its neighbor, Castle Brennenburg. The quiet forest clad mountain stress with scattered lakes is as picturesque as can be. Albeit the area is haunted by the dark. Ask any local anywhere. And you will hear proof of the widespread superstition. All travelers should indulge themselves in such conversations since it will certainly serve as exciting entertainment. All of them have their own twists on materials, but there are some motives that keep reappearing. The Gatherers. The story reaches all the way back to the time of the Thirty Years' War. It is said the soldiers who abandoned the duty get lost in the cool dark woods and forever damned the womb grinds. Their bodies rot by their tainted souls and left them disfigured and empty of essence. Many of them have cited them over the years and described them as horrid revenants. They move silently through the woods, shying away from any beholder. 
They are called the Gatherers, as they seem to follow some ambition to steal living creatures. It is their prey which can be heard struggling in, inside damp burlap sacks dragged behind them, which reveal their presence. What dark scheme do they follow? There's an undone. Henrik Cornelius Agrippa, the well known erudite, visited Alstad at the start of the 16th century. So many fancy words in this. He resided in the local inn for a fortnight and he asked for remnants of the kingdom's past. During his day, all the prominent members of the society paid notice and he was mentioned in many records at the time. One day, he went to investigate a ball in the northwestern glades, only to never be seen again. Heinrich is known to have passed away in Grenoble some ten years earlier. He dismissed the notion of ever visiting Alstad. Which makes you wonder what really happened. Who was this mysterious man who visited the sleepy hamlet in the woods and what happened to him? The Immortal Baron. The Baron of Brandenburg lives a reclusive life with his family at his castle nearby, nearby Alstead, and like most of those noble birth, most, most of those noble birth, rumors are inherited alongside with the title. Research in the history of a little before the castle was consumed by fire in the late 16th century. It, is, it was rebuilt by Alexander, a noble man from the Rhine, Rhinelands claiming the wall as protector of the Prussian, Prussian state. Alexander helped the region to flourish and remain populous throughout his presumed lifetime. The family has always been secretive when it comes to lineage and heritage, therefore the birth and death of Alexander and his offspring have never been fully recorded. This is fed the idea that the Baron is in fact the one and the same who came from the West over 300 years ago. Lived through the time of occupation and joined the coveted quarter of the Black Eagle along with the great leaders of this world. Jesus a lot, so... Oof. Boy, boy oh boy. Okay, so you said something about you click something and then you have a limited time to click something else, so uh, I'm guessing there's a puzzle here that we have to so more oil oh so I like to, oh Okay. Then that one. And then I guess there's two there. Um oh, there's one there. One there, okay, four. Okay. Hit. Hit that one. Hit that one. Okay, that wasn't that one. And then that one. Hey! Ooh, spooky passageway. I like it. Oh. There's a key there. Sweet. Anything in here? Oh, a note. Well, him and his force have endangered my research long enough with the absent minded handling of the human vessels. The sheriff is keeping a watchful eye on the force and is killing my trusty servants. It's just a matter of time until they follow the trail of Brandenburg. I need to lock up Wilhelm and his men up to avoid further investigation from the public. The wine cellar will therefore be sealed off until the matter has been handled. Either the king's men leave or they will starve. Whatever comes first, they, cannot, they can all watch for all I care. Maybe I will feed them some wine, it would be it would it would in a sense solve both of my problems. Interesting. Okay. Key oh. wine set. I'm just gonna hide in here. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if that means there's an enemy nearby. Does it? I don't know. I, I don't know. Uh, oh, oh, the door opened. Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, oh, okay. Fuck. <gasps> That's the piano. Oh, why is it doing this to me? <laughs> Game, why are you doing this to me? That's the goddamn piano. That's the goddamn piano. Oh, goddamn. God, goddamn. Hmm. Right. Okay. You have to go. Budge. My heart is racing right now. My heart is racing.
could the game just maybe not throw a monster at me in the first half an hour? Could, could it just not do that? It's literally right there. It's literally it. It's literally right there. Oh my god. Whew. Okay. Okay. You can do it. You can do it. He's the one. He was the one playing. He was the one playing the piano. He was the one playing the piano. Uh, oh, where'd it go? Just get out. Yeah, I'm gone. I'm gone. Nope. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. I think with that, uh, we've been recording for 36 minutes. I'm gonna leave the episode off there. Um, yeah, I don't like the sound of that. Uh, thank you all for watching. Um, I don't know if I will complete this game <laughs> from playing it right now, but we will see. Um, I'll definitely, I'll, I'll, this isn't the, the only episode I'm doing. I'll, I'll definitely do more. Um, if you like me being scared, make sure to leave a like and subscribe and I'll do more of these videos. So, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one. Take care and goodbye. Oh.